Hi, I'm Carmen. I'm a second year PA student at the University of Manitoba. Can you give us a little bit of an overview of what the admission requirements are for Manitoba's PA program? So you need a four-year undergrad degree. It can be in any area. There's people who have art degrees, performing arts, everything, as long as you have the required courses. So there's biochemistry, um, anatomy and physiology. Microbio is a recommended course, but not required. Um, so it's basically just the four-year undergrad degree with the required courses, and then a competitive GPA. Other than that, you had to fill out an application, which included a statement of intent. Uh, a CV and some application questions as well. Any references that were required? Yeah, so there's also three references. Uh, they recommend one be from your most recent employer. Um, on my application I had my current employer, I had um, an academic advisor at school from undergrad, and then I also had a lab manager from the lab I did my honors project in. When did you start preparing for PA admissions? So within my last year of undergrad, um, the first year I applied, the deadline was November 30th, and I had start, probably started working on my statement around September. Um, however, I, it was a little bit different the first year. So the deadline was November 30th, but the references didn't have to be in until, I think, January 1st. So I got my application in, but one of my references took a while to get the reference in. So it didn't get in until like the very last day and it was cutting it really close. The second year they changed the deadline to January 15th so both your application and your references had to be in on the same day. Um, so the second time around, I probably also started working on my application still around September. I took a lot more time to write my statement of intent um, and to get people to edit it for me and go through it with me uh, before sending it in. Were there any books, websites or resources that you used to help you prepare for admissions? Um, for admissions, I don't know if there was any books. For the interview though, I did use the Doing It Right book to help prepare um, in terms of medical ethics. For the application, I did use a lot of websites that I had kind of found through social media. Uh, so I was big following people on Instagram and using the Facebook page for resources and reaching out to other current students for tips and advice. Um, and watching YouTube videos to prepare for the um, MMIs and the interviews were really helpful as well. MMI can be very challenging. Mm -hmm. um, so what, what was your approach for preparing for the MMI? Uh, I actually thought the MMIs were really fun. I think I was like the only person, but I really enjoyed it after it. Um, my approach to preparing, so I had practiced with friends, um, family as well, who we kind of go through questions. I also when I was practicing on my own, I would write my answer out instead of just think through it or speak it out because then I could look back and see what I, I had said and almost edit it in a way um, by writing it out. I had also, um, I had someone recommend that I videotape myself speaking so you can kind of find all your flaws. Um, so that was another way I prepared, reading about medical ethics. I had taken a course on it in undergrad, but I, the Doing It Right book I found was really helpful for refreshing on kind of ways to approach situ situations and there's definitely stations in the MMI when I was answering questions where I was like, I remember this in the book, this helped me a lot, so that helped. Mm -hmm.